Right. I stashed them down here. <laughs> so that's where you've been hiding. I think I'm ready to go now. Pfft. I've been practiced since high school. I'm probably super. Uh, Allie, she's gonna be so awkward. I can't believe I'm about to leave this room for the last time. Okay, I'm pretty much done here. I just need to grab my goblin and I'm off. I know most of these by heart at this point. You stay here. Educate the youngsters in classic cinema. Hey, little guy. You're gonna be reunited with your sister soon. Cool. I guess I'm totally ready to go now. No way. Remember how mad she'd get if we didn't use the compost? And she always knew when we were lying. Waste not, or kiss the planet go- You need a hand with that? Mm, no, it should be fine. Okay. If we just get this board out of the way, I could probably squeeze through. So we need something to pry it off. Uh. It's screwed in pretty good. We need a screwdriver. I think I saw one back in the shed. Let's go check. Any? Yep. I don't want to think about what might be living inside it, though. Well, better a lot. Hey, it's locked, all right. Okay. There should be something in here that'll work. I guess Marianne left us something useful, huh? Yeah. We still have to find a way to get inside, though. And please, no broken windows. We'll see ya. What's happening? Do you feel that? And don't leave this room until everything looks as clean as a whistle. Ugh. This is the millionth time I've gotten in trouble because of you. You and your big mouth. Hey, you were thinking the same thing. You just weren't brave enough to tell her. What good would it do? It's not like she ever listens to us anyway. Well, I'd rather scream it right in her stupid face than be a quiet little mouse. Oh, we forgot the key. We need to put it back. Maybe we could hide it somewhere. I guess we know where to search now. We just have to remember which one is the silent frog. Nothing here. So, which one of you is hiding the key, hmm? Damn, where's the key? Seriously? Kidding. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, okay, sorry. Nice job keeping a secret, buddy. At least the shed's still standing. Yep. I don't want to think about what might be living inside it, though. Well, better alive than dead. Ugh, yes. Let's deal with that later. Plenty else to do first. Huh. Who left this box here? It looks brand new. It wasn't me. Has someone been out here recently? Got it. All this for a screwdriver? You got a better idea how to get in? You sure you want to go in there? 
This was our very first den, remember? Who knows what lives down there now? Ouch! Are you okay? What happened? I just hit my head like an idiot. Wait. What? Where are you? Ty. I'm outside. But I can hear you in my head. Our voice. It's back. Holy shit. I, uh, don't suppose you're dragons. Straight ahead. Need to go left, I think. Then left again after the goblins. Wow. Can't say I ever expected to see you again. It's been a long time, buddy. Nope. It was on the right. My bad. Wait. That was our treasure? It's just trap. Marianne grilled us about all these pink. It always had to be pink. I found her old kite. <laughs> I think its wings have been clipped, though. Rest in peace, brave bird. Past the treasure. Straight, Straight ahead. ahead. You know, I almost convinced myself our voice was just the mad hunter. Why am I still afraid to say his name? He was Marianne's creation. She made all the creepy characters. Yo, what are you doing down there? What do you think I'm doing? Trying to figure out if anything in Marianne's mess is worth keeping. Any progress? Not really. What about you? What are you doing up there? Uh, you know, just plotting world domination. Ah, that's a big responsibility. Not sure if you can hack it, Ronan. <laughs> oh, ye of little faith. I guess it is about time to check our bedroom. I'll be up in a second. Now this, this feels like home. So much for my dream of being a hockey star. Marianne, that's you know, if there's one thing you gotta give Marianne, it's that she let us explore our artistic side. You should have seen Eddie's face when I tried to repaint his car. Yeah, I bet Uncle Eddie didn't appreciate your artistic touch. I'd rather you call them Chief Brown if you're gonna be an ass about it. Hey, the postcard we sent ourselves from Juno. Forever alone. What? We barely had any friends. We even had to be our own pen pals. We never appreciated this view as kids. Look what I found! What? Only our greatest creation, the Book of Goblins. <laughs> Seriously? It was in- All these stories. I had ideas for so many more. Marianne wrote- Ah, where is it? You looking for something in particular? My diary. You never told me about it. Yeah. With the way Marianne was, I tried extra hard to keep it a secret. Marianne. Yeah, that day she found out about it. 